a la afición de Ipica TV y de Quan Edge. Bienvenido al show de pronósticos para el Epic Five de este viernes 16 de septiembre en Goldstream Park. Nos acompaña Scotty McKeever, Pascual Artiles por entrar al show. Durante el show va a entrar y va a dar sus pronósticos también y veremos su ticket. Buenos días, Scotty. Let's start with race number five. Vamos a empezar con la quinta carrera, first leg of the Epic Five, race five. All right, buenos días from uh, Goldstream Park. I'm in the Express Bet Select Suites back here. Oh, wait, I think you're just like a stone's throw from me, right? <laughs> How far are you from me? Are you right there? Are you right by me? Two, two doors away. Two doors away, so I can throw some rocks at you. Yeah, especially in the next race. <laughs> okay. All right. I'm. You know, you you want to just cover the race here, and and you you cover the uh, one, two, three, and four. Oriental Park is Equine Edge's top pick. And uh, this horse was even money last time out and really didn't have a very good trip. Now goes to, and you know, this horse is actually not bad, but it's got a very low GSR, but D'Angelo De takes over for this horse. It is the top Equine Edge pick. So maybe it's going to do something in here. Uh, but uh, I decided I, I, I couldn't really separate these four horses. So I just use these four. So uh, for Scotty, so para Scotty, el uno, el dos, el tres y el cuatro, una carrera muy discreta. Las dos primeras selecciones de Quan Edge, Oriental Park, el 1 y el 2, Berrazano in the Sky. Y el Long Shot, el número 3, Royal Harry en las selecciones. Y él agregó a North eh, Caucasus, el número 4, para complementar. I agree. Yo también eh, estoy de acuerdo con esto. Y Pascual, que está entrando al show, está también con el 1, el 2, el 3 y el 4 en su ticket. Así que, Scotty, Pascual... Y yo estamos de acuerdo. We all agree with number one, two, three, four. Ahí están los, las selecciones de Pascual. Uno, dos, tres y cuatro en la carrera cinco. Let's go to race six. Vamos a la sexta carrera, Scotty. All right. I know Pascual is having some technical issues going on. But uh, here's a look at his ticket right here as well. So he likes the one, two, three, and four. Okay. I'm going to take a chance here. Look, at if you're going to get some big scores, you have to take some risks. Now, It makes me happy to know that you didn't even use Felix, this four horse. And this four horse is the horse you're going to probably have to beat because there's so, much, there's so much speed in this race between the one, three, seven, and eight. Very, a lot of speed. And this is going to set it up for the four horse Felix, but this is not a bad horse. And this horse pressed, brushed, and dueled in the last two races. Now cuts back in distance, goes on the synthetic, and there's a lot of speed. I think. Gonzalez, Edwin is going to run, get a masterful trip here. He's going to sit behind and make a run. That's what I think. Así es. Scotty dice que para acertar un buen ticket del Epic Five, a veces hay que tomar riesgos. Y el riesgo que él está tomando, está viendo que hay mucha velocidad en la carrera. Como pueden ver en la columna Pace, el 3, el 8, el 1 y el 7 tienen 76, 76, 79, 79. Mucha velocidad en la carrera. Y él cree que Félix, que va a intentar por primera vez la superficie sintética de tapeta en Goldstream, va a correr colocado detrás de ellos y en la recta final va a investir para obtener la victoria. Así que se lanzó con este long shot, este best bet de Félix. No sé ni cómo denominarlo en la sexta carrera. For me, you are wrong. <ríe> para mí estás equivocado. <risa> Pero eh, eh, I, I really think this horse is, is, is not winning, but Well, I, I respect that you are uh, using that. I, I, I respect that. A lot of respect. If he wins, well, I think I, I, you would deserve a lunch. Me dice un almuerzo si pega esta base. Scotty, el número cuatro, el caballo. Félix, Pascual. Well, let's see Pascual ticket to show the, the audience para mostrar a la audiencia sus caballos. For Pascual, one, three, four, seven, eight. Para Pascual, una carrera difícil. Uno, tres, cuatro, siete y ocho para asegurar la sexta carrera. Let's go to race seven. Vamos a la séptima carrera. Let's hear uh, Scotty's analysis. Vamos a escuchar el, el análisis, Scotty. Well, I strictly think that you have to probably beat the three horse. Infinite Diamond, right? This is probably the horse to beat. It's Equine Edge's second pick. This horse is 50% to win. And this horse is uh, coming in from Del Mar, believe it or not. So I'm not really sure why they shipped this horse from the first race at Goldstream Park to Del Mar, and now comes back here for Patrick Biancone. But this horse deserves a look. Maybe is going to probably um, have to beat the one horse, though, uh, for uh, Gutierrez. But this horse got a nice second-place finish. You know, all you're looking for is horses to improve 
in their second time out. And that's exactly what happened last time out here with uh, Penumbras Maker. So, but uh, I decided to just use the one, three, and four. I think honored the lady as a first time starter for Safi Joseph Jr. And uh, I think you have to use that two to one on the Equinedge morning line. So I, I use these three horses. Eh, para Scotty, una carrera donde el número 3, Infinite Diamond, eh, luce con una enorme posibilidad de ganar 50% en el win percentage, en el GSR, en la eh, genética, tiene 70 puntos. Eh, fíjense que él utiliza al 1, al 3 y al 4, que son los tres ejemplares con más genética de top 3 GSR en this race. 1, 3 and 4, los tres en el ticket de Scotty. Eh, mejoró mucho Penumbras Maker, el número 1 en su última. Eh, y el número 4, Honor D. Lady, hija de Honor Code, debuta eh, con eh, buenos ejercicios para esta carrera y tiene un pedigrí poderoso, el Top Gear SAR para el número 4, la, la genética más alta. 1, 3 y 4 para Scotty. Let's see the ticket for Pascual. Vamos a ver el ticket de Pascual. He agrees. 1, 3 and 4. 1, 3 y 4 for Pascual. Also, también para Pascual. 1, 3 y 4. Eh, vamos entonces. Let's go to race number 8. Vamos a hablar de la octava carrera. Let's talk about race eight. Hablemos de la octava, Scott. All right. So All right, here's so the this race, right? So you have two very fast horses in Demo Wonder, the one, and Numero uh, Tres, Kitana. Look at this. These horses are two very, very fast horses that look to need the lead. The three horse looks to be even faster than the one. I think these two horses are going to probably duel. So I, I decided to add a couple of more horses in there with the five. Coaches, Jer's Joy, and of course the seven horse, uh, Jumeria. So I'm, I'm going to use those four horses, one, three, five, and seven. I'm expecting the one and three to duel. Así es. Para Scotty, dice que va a haber un duelo de velocidad entre el uno de A Wonder y el tres Gitana. Muy rápidas ambas, ambas de Rohan Crichton. Eh, el, por eso coloca a dos ejemplares que van a correr de menos a más como Coach, eh, Joy, eh, George, eh, Joy, Y el número 7, Jumeira. Así que 1, 3, 5, 7 para Scotty. I have a long shot in this race. Yo tengo un long shot en esta carrera. El número 4, Bluefield. Bluefield is my long shot in this race. I like her a lot. For me, I, I will use 1, 3, 5, 7. And I will add the 4 para Scotty. Eh, eh, ya vimos 1, 3, 5 y 7. Let's see, Pascual, I think, has then a wonder, has a single Scotty. Vamos a ver. Wait, 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 wait. Hold, hold, on. Hold, on. hold on a second. You you just say you like the four horse a lot, yet you covered 18 horses in the race. What is that? No, I'm saying that you have one, three, five, seven, and I will add the number four blue field. Okay. okay. But you don't, so you don't like the four a lot. No, it's, my, it's a long shot in this race. This race is very tough. It's muy difícil esta carrera. Okay, so Alfredo, the, the, the four. Okay, so I smell a bet here, but okay, we'll talk about that later. Um, okay. Uh, I will let, just say let's this. see. My four, horse, Pascual like, a, my four horse has a better chance of winning than your four horse. I will tell you that. Okay, that's, let, that's let's see. Uh, Pascual's ticket. That, that trash talking is not working today. And no, the number one, then I wonder. Then I wonder, el uno es la base de Pascual para la pick five. Uh, very risky, in my opinion. is a tough race, this race eight. Una difícil, eh, pero Pascual se arriesgó con el número uno, then I wonder. Let's see, race nine, la última carrera, the last race of the sequence, la novena carrera, and Scotty. Y Scotty. Oh, I, I think this is of the sequence. I think this is the toughest race. It's interesting to me that you have a horse in the seven horse song runner who's 45 to one on the Equine Edge morning line. And this is the second top win percentage. So it's a very interesting horse. Uh, Dominican Ice is the horse to beat, the three horse for sure. But this horse went off at 40% and 50% in the last couple of races and still lost. So I just, I had to try to, to beat this three, but this three is the horse to beat for sure. Eh, para Scotty, una carrera difícil, la carrera de cierre, está utilizando hasta cuatro números, tres, cinco, seis y siete, three, five, six and seven for Scotty, Dominican Ice, he thinks he's the horse to beat, uh, but he's a horse that he's trying to beat also, uh, he thinks he's vulnerable, so he added the five, six and seven, for me, I took a big risk in this race, I used the number six, little big, as a single, yo creo que el seis, 
eh, va a ganar de punta a punta, de punta, a punta. Yo, I think the number six Little Big is going to eh, go gate to wire in the last race at Gorton. Así que el 6 como base para este servidor. Eh, wishing you good luck today, Scotty, with that uh, Felix. And let's see uh, the ticket of Pascual to check his last race. Vamos a ver el ticket de Pascual en su última carrera. He has the same number than Scotty. 3, 5, 6, and 7, 3, 5, 6, y 7. The only difference between Scotty and Pascual in, in, on, in this sequence is the single. Uh, Scotty is using Felix number 4 in race 6. Scotty está usando el 4, Felix en la carrera 6. And Pascual is using Dena Wonder, el 1 en la octava, y Pascual está usando este número 1 en la octava como base. So good luck, guys. And we continue with more on Ipica TV and Equanesh. Continuamos con más en Ipica TV y Equanesh. Good luck. Buena suerte. All right, Anna, we'll see you uh, we'll see, uh, we'll see tomorrow.